Hey, Kelly Ritchie here. Let's jam. We've looked at Crossroads Blues. This is the same thing, but at a slower tempo. All right. This will be at 90 beats per minute. Uh, the quicker version is at 120 beats per minute. And keep in mind that any blues song can become your own. Take this song, use it as a ball of clay, and make it your own. So I'm going to do a couple of verses of rhythm then play a little bit of lead, get out of the way, and it's all yours. I like to say blues guitar is three chords and the truth. Learn from the greats, make it your own, write your own song with these chords, take these riffs, turn them into something that's yours. Muddy Waters said it best, the blues had a baby, named it rock and roll. It's very true, all right? Let's jam. Now let me show you the riff for this. Now you've got a drone with your A string ringing open. Now the framework of this riff and then I play a D7 chord get a little bit funky with it. In the quick version, I get real funky with it. Back to the riff. E7, D7, riff is in A, then I play an E7 sharp 9. So if you want to go deeper with this song and learn how to play it in the Blues Guitar for Beginners here in this channel, you can find a version of Crossroads towards the end. That series has 19 lessons, which is my basic teaching platform. Uh, and it was one of the first series of videos that I shot. And then that sets you up to learn eight songs. Crossroads Blues is one of them. So if you wanna hit pause, review that song, then come back and play it, great, please do so. Now, if you wanna go deeper with this song, check out my True Fire channel. I've got a whole song pack on a quick version and this slower version that we're getting ready to play. It's 145 in the key of A. It does bring in that crossroad riff, but you can turn this into anything. Any blue song, make it your own. Let's jam. As I hit the play button, please be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. This is the intro. we go.
all yours. 